I know it looks really black in here, but it's actually a full moon. It's kind of actually a bright, a bright night out here. But we're going to flip some lights on. And that is what we see with the regular lights. And that's what we see with the brights. Not a whole lot. We're going to replace these headlights tomorrow, and then I'll try to test this again tomorrow night and see if these new LED lights are any brighter. So these LED lights, swapping them out, and uh, basically you've got this metal retaining ring with two screws on the top, two screws on the bottom, and then there's just your uh, light plug-in on the back, and then you put the new metal retaining ring around this, plug that in, put those four screws back, that should be it. Here's the old headlight. Doesn't pass the shake test. <laughs> Anywho, so yeah, there's your original plug-in. There's the plug-in for this LED light. And I've put that metal ring on here. Now we're just going to feed that back into the headlight hole. And you've got a screw, 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 screw. And on these old ones here, this is an older style headlight. The new things aren't like this anymore. But this one right here is an adjuster. You unscrew that to aim the headlight down. Screw it in to aim it up. And this one here controls your left and right on the, uh, the spread of the, uh, the headlight. And anywho, that's irrelevant to most people because new vehicles aren't like that. But let's slap her back together. Okay, this is the after with those new LED headlights. I think that's a little brighter. And that's just a regular. Let's see what the head, the uh, high beams look like. A little bit better on high beam, or does it, it looks? I don't know. It looks kind of like it. Looks like it fades down a little bit on camera. But uh, I feel like I can see a bit better with these. Out of people's, there you are. So the uh, that dimming when I went from high beams to low beams, that was the the camera was trying to adjust for the change in, in lighting on the on the, on the video. The uh, the brights are actually pretty good, and uh, I'm happy with uh, with what I'm seeing on this initial test. I'm happy with that. But uh, truth be told, I'm not a big fan of LED headlights because when they're coming at you at night, they are blinding and just, it drives me crazy. But I, I got these. Uh, big reason is because I do not do a lot of night driving. I should be at my destination way before the sun goes down. If if I'm getting to my destination and it's dark, it's because something happened and I didn't make my schedule. What, whatever it is, something happened. And a lot of things were, I'm off in the woods, you got a lot of tree cover and canopy and things like that. It's really, really hard for me to see. And I've driven by, like, my turns uh, to places. I've driven by them multiple times and just kind of going back and forth. I just couldn't see, couldn't, couldn't just couldn't see well enough. So, uh, yeah, I don't, uh, I'm not a big fan of the LEDs, but I don't do a lot of driving. And it just, um, I just need, uh, need more light sometimes for when, uh, when things happened and I can't find where I'm supposed to be. But these really should help make my life a little bit easier on those rare occasions. And I'm all about being easy. I like being cheap too, but I'm really, really all about being easy. Talk to you later.